शांति ओम शांति ओम शांति ओम शांति ओम शांति इतना शांत में बैठे थे you all were sitting in silence and when the white light was on everyone started getting out kaise khare ho raha hai ji chahta how do you feel to stand up when the white light is on would you not like to sit in meditation ye humko thar sunday cemetery eight me meche vyavrat baba ne in 1978 ट्रेन इज लेट the meditation can be done jo sare vishwa ko this third international day has its own significance at that time this is maintained all over the world sabhi jagah ye ek ghanta this one hour is especially bale waise bhi baithte hain roz sham ko is to do the service to the mind shubh raya deti hu and therefore i give you this good suggestion kuch bhi ho jaye that let anything happen kal baba ne kaha just as yesterday baba said kya kal baba ne kaha be fikr baat baba said that you all are carefree emperors The one who always remains in their intoxication never comes under any worry. The matters come and they go. So all the day you all have done. The rest of the day you all have done. Wonderful. Today's Murli is was so very wonderful. It was as if Baba was speaking directly to us. Ninety-five and ninety-five. The revised date of today's Murli was of the year nineteen seventy-five. कितना मेरा मीठा बाबा प्यारा बाबा एक एक शब्द ऐसे उच्चारण करता है. Baba speaks in such a way. जो एक शब्द में that whatever he speaks many miracles happen dil khush dimag thanda the heart feels happy the nature becomes simple so you are the ones who are carefree emperors isn't it koi fikr nahi hai you don't have any worry kyun dil khush hai why Why you are not having any worry because your heart is very happy. Don't keep anything in your heart. Yesterday, Baba spoke about everyone's mind as what thoughts are created in the mind. Buddhi sato jati buddhi. Dhana gyan ki buddhi me hoti hai. the intellect always helps the mind Baba in doing anything babas sweet versions are touched to the hearts man apne aap man mana bhav the mind constantly stays in man mana bhav and when there is man mana bhav there is madhya ji bhav along bhavishya mai aankhon ke samne our future is in front of our eyes and that vision appears again and again as what i become in the future to us pe ek baar baba ki baat yaad aati hai i remember baba's words but mujhe sare dil mein koi na koi baat sa kai baba ki yaad aati hai some sakar baba's words are always remembered in my intellect baba had once said 
that you have to remember these two words as whether the fruition is great or making effort is great. Which is great? We say that making effort is very great, but Baba said no. You have, you have in your intellect as what you will be becoming in the future. So in order to become anything in the future, the main basis is making effort. Know the value of this confluence age. In the future, you will be receiving the reward, but at the confluence age, you need to make all, a lot of effort. Yesterday, I sat beside Baba to feed him. I said, Baba, yesterday. So the people who were staying in London, they asked me as Baba, uh, Dadi, what did you speak or whisper in Baba's ear? What did you whisper in Baba's ear? I said, Baba, there is God and fortune. So to sit beside God is also a great fortune. God is sitting and I am so fortunate that I am sitting beside him. This is the destiny and this destiny is fixed but practically I had a lot of happiness that God is my companion. Now one whose companion is God, they definitely doesn't have any fear or worry. Only by having the realization that God is my companion, there are a lot more benefits. What Baba might have told about the benefits? God is my companion. And what is the practical proof for that? Baba had already said, God is my companion and I am an observer. It's so now wonderful. If it is to be told in Sindhi language, it rhymes very well. So, Sati and Sakshi, companion and observer. Be an observer and see the drama plan. Make Baba as your companion. So, companion and observer. These two things are really wonderful. And Baba spoke about being double crowned. Automatic. Feeling at the air. You automatically get the feeling light ka crown. that now there is the crown of light and then there will be the crown of purity. Definitely you will be having double crown. Now along with the crown of light, you are making effort in order to attain the reward. Shiva. Yad. Service, remembrance Yad are the hai. only two things to be made in while making effort. So what is effort? Shiva. Effort is nothing but doing service and remembering the Father. <coughs> Shiva mein yaad karne mein time lagenga. In service, when you Lagi remember Shiva the Father, it takes para. time. You may be sometimes busy in your service, so hardly you can remember the Father. Yad 
So everything was explained in today's Murli. Shiva. Manshavacha karmana. Service is doing service through mind, words and deeds. Vani jo daruri honga. Continue to do service through the mind. And wherever you definitely karma need to speak or do service hai. through words, there you have to speak. Raj yogi ban rahe hai na. Raj because yogi now you are the ones who are becoming easy Raj Yogis. So, and thirdly, your every action should resemble the father's remembrance. There is happiness at the time of doing service, enjoyment when doing service. <coughs> Internally, you first have happiness and then you will enjoy to do service. When you were uh, sitting in remembrance, uh, did you enjoy anything? Was there isn't any enjoyment when sitting in meditation? What were you doing altogether? Our duty says, and Baba also has given signals and directions. And we also have the calendars in front of us. From second Sunday, always the third Sunday is also remembered. The entire world comes in front of our vision when we sit in this third Sunday. God has given us the gift to stay in peace, love, happiness, power, etc. You all were sitting in this remembrance, isn't it? Whatever Baba has bestowed on you, that have to be in the emerged form. And with the power of this gathering, the vibrations are reached or reaches to the world. Why? Because day by day, the worldly people will also come to know as what Brahma Kumaris are actually doing. This principle has been bestowed to us by God Himself. So, from starting from Amrutvela, our task begins. In order to check oneself, sit personally in front of Baba. Be an obedient and faithful and insincere child. I shouldn't come in number wise, but I have to become number one. One should have this pure thought, a determined thought. Elevated thought. The one which today Baba said that this has to become your nature. <coughs> the pure thoughts, the elevated thoughts and the determined thoughts should become your nature. Only then the mind stays happy. And what else you want to think about? Buddhi yoga bhi laga sakti hai. 
the intellect yoga is connected with the father's remembrance it becomes very easy to inculcate anything what baba says the mind and the intellect never comes under any influence or under any fluctuations if you don't have knowledge remembrance and dharna okay you may be doing service but you are influenced by nature or the sanskars of others then it becomes very difficult Say my Baba. Yesterday Baba spoke very nicely. Baba said the greatest medicine is my Baba. And now the doctors are free. Baba had given a very good medicine yesterday. Just say my Baba and that is the greatest medicine. My Baba itself is a medicine. All the diseases, they run away. I asked myself, that blessings are also a great medicine. Speak sweetly, speak slowly. And this is one good record to be maintained. Never come under the influence of anyone's nature or sanskars. Whenever you find time, go beyond sound. Only once Sakar Baba told me, and I myself was checking the chart and used to keep attention on myself. Baba asked me, are you seeing the chart? I just smiled. So Baba asked me, I will ask in front of the gathering that uh, do you don't cause sorrow to anyone? And if you cause sorrow to anyone, then that your chart becomes bad. That moment is not forgotten. Let anything happen. Or no matter what happens, to cause sorrow, to give, take sorrow, means that you are spoiling your own record. Enjoy the instant fruit and the instant fruit is happiness. Remember Baba's versions in your mind and intellects. It is Baba's versions and let there be Baba's versions in mind and in the intellect. So today I constantly remember about being the carefree emperor. So one should go into this depth. Who are the ones who really taught about to remain carefree emperors and who has gone into the depth of this word? Raise your hands. Some are gradually lifting their hands. And this is why I told Sister Shada early in the morning that uh, as always I would come to the class in the gathering to take class. I don't like to miss the class in the evening. 
If I see you all and if I have no spiritual chit chat with you, then I don't have any enjoyment. How will I say good night to Baba? Our brothers and sisters are really wonderful. I had sent that brother at the time of sleeping at night and I told that brother that you forgive everyone before you go to sleep. Forgive everyone before going to sleep and before you open your eyes in the morning, Baba will forgive you. So did you all understand what I'm saying? Clap hands now. It was written, Dadi Om Shanti, and that means that whatever you do throughout the day, you forgive or if anybody causes your sorrow, you forgive them before you go to sleep at night. And early in the morning, before you open your eyes, Baba will forgive you. Have the feeling of forgiving others. It was to rain Baba smoothly. That you should have the feeling of forgiving others. And only then you will not come under the fluctuations of any sanskars or natures of others. You would then not make a lot of effort to forgive anyone. So whatever you want to do now, it is the right time to do now. And keep this mantra in your intellect. So whatever to be done should be done today. And whatever should be done today should be done now. And if you keep anything good for tomorrow, then it will become something else. Okay? Om Shanti.